Hello, it's Pamela, and you are on Pamela's Adoring Crochet. I would like to say welcome to my channel, and if you are new to my channel, um, I'm all about crochet. I would want to show you guys what I'm up to. Um, I do have a giveaway, so be sure and check out that video. Um, I'm going to be posting it here in just a minute. Um, after making this video, I'm not sure if I'm going to post it before or after, but be sure and look out for it. It's going to be um, Annie's it's going to be Annie's uh, digital uh, pattern here, and it's going to be for three skeins of this coffee sh premier. There it is, premier coffee shop yarn. So you may want to go check out that. Um, I was going to show you what I did make for the video um, for that. My first top that I've ever made, and I'm so excited! Yes, and it came out perfect. You know, at the, I read, I did all the instructions and everything just went right into play. And so I'm so excited. This is definitely a pattern I'm going to want to make more of. And it's uh, called the Beach Walk Tunic. And it's from Annie's Signature Design. And the, the designer, her name is R-O-H-N. So I don't know if that's Ron or Ron. I'm not sure. Um, but anyway, Strong is the last name. It's for Annie, Annie's Signature Design. And that's where I got this pattern, but here it is. Let's see. I've had it on, so I wanna make sure I got everything straight on it, but here it is. I mean, look at that. I'm so excited. I love all these hoes that are in it like that. Nice and breezy. Yes, yes, yes. Um, I did not have the three weight cotton yarn that was needed that the pattern called for. So I used my coffee shop and it has 15% wool in it. So I'll see, I mean, I'm sure I can use this like now and throughout the spring and stuff. And I don't know as far as like when summer gets here, but I do plan on making another one. And so I'm gonna try to get me some of the yarn that the, they say to use uh, a three weight cotton yarn <laughs> so that I can see. But anyway, here it is. Um, Here's the bottom right here, and there is a six inch split, which is perfect. I love this. So the front and back is basically the same, and I just did a couple single crochet around the neck edge. But okay, here we go, there it is opened up. See, isn't that cool? I mean, perfect for summer, spring and summer. And I went to Walmart and just bought me a navy blue tank top for like two eighty six is all. And so I think I'm gonna go ahead and get go back and get the gray tank top because um, the blue looked good with it, but I think the gray wearing a lighter color will show the hose up better, kind of like they do in this right here. You can see the tank underneath it more. So I think my the reason I didn't as much when I wear it is because. Um, I have a dark tank underneath it. So I'm definitely going to go back and get that lighter gray. Um, okay, so on with that. I'm done with that project and I get to move on. One of the projects that I am working on is, I'm finally getting to it. So Jennifer Kofer, if you're watching, this is for you, girl. This is my daughter's. <laughs> I started this around Christmas and we're already in March. <laughs> and it's an easy pattern. I'm actually just throwing it together myself. I, I actually don't have a pattern. So when I say pattern, it's just something I'm throwing together and writing my notes down. Um, but I do plan on making me one of these. So if I do, I'll do a tutorial on it if I make another one. Um, okay, yeah, here it is. It's going to be a vest, but here's the colors right here. And she's pretty tall. She's like 5'7". Unlike me, I'm like 5'2". So mine won't quite be this long. And this was one cake of this anti-peeling DK color yarn by Premier. And the color is mm, suede. Here's the color. So what I'm going to do with this is I'm actually done with the back panel. And I really want to uh, control the colors. So I went to Premiere and I ordered three more of these. No, I'm sorry, two more of these because I already had one. So I ordered two more because I wasn't sure 
I want to, you know, cut the colors and be able to color, I mean, uh, what was that word again? <laughs> I want to be able to color control. I'm sorry, guys. Um, it's just crazy this morning. Um, I want to color control this right here. So that's what I plan on doing. And if you haven't bought this yarn, you do need to check it out because it is very, very soft yarn. In fact, it, if I'd had more of it, I probably would have made the um, Annie's tunic in it. So, well, I know why I didn't. One reason, well, I didn't have any yarn to do it with anyway. But I think one reason why I don't want to is I don't like, uh, <laughs> can't even think of the word again. I, I don't like to color control. <laughs> I don't know why I'm having a problem with that word this morning. But I don't want to have to color control another top. That's a lot of work. And so I'm going to do it for the best to get it done. But I really don't care to do that much anymore. So, yeah. I probably won't make another one where it's self-striping as, as far as a top. Okay. So that's all with that. Um, oh, yeah. On my top that I made, I said it took three of these coffee shop and the true blue. I don't even know if I said this a while ago. Gosh, I am so out of it this morning. Used the three light. I used the coffee shop. And this is what I had left of the third skein of it. Right here. Third cake, I guess you could say. That's what was left. So, and that was a medium that I made. And I am going to make a small the next time. But three of these coffee shops will do a small, medium, and a large. The extra large and the 2X, I think it may take at least another cake. Okay, now, the other thing is, <laughs> um, I got my Happy Mail. I ordered Premier Yarn, and I do have another order coming in, by the way, but um, it's not here yet. But I ordered me another one of these. It's the anti-peeling DK color, and it's in Mac Macroon. It's a three light. There's 383 yards in it, and there's the color wave. And I honestly don't know why I ordered this one color. I am really thinking that there was a shawl, probably from Fiber Flux, most likely. I love all her stuff. So it might be something there. I I'm going to have to check my notes to see if I wrote something down. But when I got it in, I was like, why did I order just one of those? So it must be a Charlotte or a summer cow or something. You know what I mean? To only have ordered one. Yeah. So I must be one, must have been wanting to do something for summer like that. Okay. So I do like it. The colors are very pretty and very summery. <laughs> Okay, the other thing is, yay, I'm so excited over this. I got my, let's see, this is the Cinnamon Stitches Try Me Pack. Yay, I got it, got it, got it. Oh, I've been waiting for this. Okay, there's a little note in the back of it from Cinnamon Stitches, and I'm sure everyone has seen all the videos, so all of you have seen what, you know, heard all that there is to hear about it, but I don't care. I'm sorry. I'm excited. And I want to get into this, um, the fade shawl that she, pattern that she has. Oh, gosh. I can't wait to get started on it. I saw B, uh, let's see, B Hook on Crochet. I saw her video, I mean, her uh, little video or whatever where she'd made it. And, oh, my gosh, she did a great job. But I have seen other, I don't know if I've seen really too many videos on the uh, finished part of it. But I've seen lots of uh, like Instagram and Facebook posts and stuff. Okay, so here are the three colors. Look at that. And I do have the pattern. I, if you don't have the pattern to it, it's free. Go to Simmons Stitches on uh, Facebook, and there's a link there that you can click and get the pattern. So I've already got it printed out. This is called Premier Yarns Deborah Norville Everyday Anti-Peeling. And it is 203 yards. Um, it's a medium four weight. But there's there it is. This is going to be great for this uh, spring and summer. Look at that. 
especially like when you go to restaurants or even in the church house, you know, they always keep it cold in the church house. Um, something like this is going to be perfect for that. So, um, yeah, I got that. So excited. Um, I don't know if I'm going to be able to get, yeah, I can get them back in there. <laughs> okay, I'm going to read my la uh, letter later. Um, actually, I've already heard the letter from on Facebook, I mean on um, YouTube. So, the other one I got, I'm not going to pass up Creative Grandma. She did one too. So, here are her colors. And so, I am going to um, do something with hers as well. I, what I like about it is the difference between the two is that uh, Jennifer's from Cinnamon Stitches is more of the calm type thing. And then Creative Grandma's is the like the bold, outgoing, fun. So it's like you got a choice of two different ones. Uh, you can have your calm, cool type colors, or then you can have your bold, fun colors. Look at that. So, I was in love with all with both sets, and I thought, well, I'm going to support both and get both of them. Oh, yeah, I forgot to say what those colors are, but you probably already know. Uh, so, this one is called Sunshine, and this one is called Parrot. That's a cool name for that. And then this one we have is Wild Blue. <laughs> and they're made in Turkey. So here they are, all three together. So I'm excited about this one just as much as I am about doing cinnamon stitches. So Creative Grandma, I love the colors that you picked. I mean, this is going to be fun. And um, I'm sure that whatever is made with it, there will be lots of compliments. And I'll read the letters later. Um, okay. Now, the last but not least, I won a giveaway on December the 25th, 2019. And I received it yesterday. <laughs> um, but it came from Germany. So, um, it is from J. Hook Crochet and more, Reggie. And, um, yeah, this is the little box of goodies that I won. That's a long time coming from Germany, isn't it? So, I won um, two of these. And it says, Jazz Strick, Strick Yarn, handmade with love. And I have never seen this yarn before. I've never heard of this yarn before. And I really can't tell anything on the back. I don't understand what it's saying. But anyway, <laughs> there it is. And then here's the tag on it. Thank you, Reggie. I love this. This is going to be interesting to work with. It's, you know, that's really strange. It looks like the yarn has actually kind of already, it has like a knitted look to it. That's interesting. I like it. Okay. Then it came with this little Christmas sweater kit. And it shows on the back. I guess you can buy more. But this is going to be cute. Um, oh, and then look at this. Pom-pom. This will be my first pom-pom to have. So, I like that. Um, oh, and then it came with some cookies. And they're Christmas cookies. <laughs> that cracked me up when I saw that. Um, oh, yeah. That's the Germany thing. Okay, and then it came with one more thing here. Uh, I'm going to have to get my scissors on this. It came with... Um, I don't know the language on it. <laughs> but it says underneath it does say, At the Heart of Pine Trees. It's hand cream. It is nice. So there's some hand cream. <laughs> okay, then it has some um, hand soap to go with it. Nice. So that was my giveaway win back on December the 25th. And it's so funny because 
when I did get it and it said from Germany and I was like, oh my gosh, what did I order? You know, because this is, it's been three months now and I have just plum forgot all about that giveaway. And, you know, because December the 25th, I mean, that was Christmas day. So there was a, been a lot going on since then. But anyway, so it was exciting when I opened it up and I was like, oh man, this is nice. And then I saw the little note from Reggie and saying that, you know, and so what I did is I went to her YouTube channel and looked up her videos to, to see if it was, you know, did I really win something or was I like a backup winner or something, you know, that I didn't know about and they went ahead and sent it to me anyway. You know, I don't know, but, um, I did it, it. My name was called out on that and thank you Reggie for that. This was really, really nice of you to do. I appreciate this so much. I mean, these items, especially this yarn here is something that I've never tried before. And I do look forward to using this yarn for something. Uh, it is perfect for the spring coming up those colors right there. So Reggie, if you are watching this, I'm going to tag you and everyone, please go check out her channel. I do watch her quite a bit. Um, so like I said, the only reason why I forgot about it, I think it just because it had a lot to do with Christmas going on and stuff, you know, and all that. And I think I probably just plum forgot about it. Um, but anyway, so that's all that I have. Uh, please go check out um, Reggie's channel, and I will leave a link to Annie's. Uh, it is an affiliate link, uh, but I will leave a link to where I got the sweater, and um, I'll leave a link to the giveaway in that as well. So, anyway, thank you, and I appreciate you stopping by, and uh, please like, share, and subscribe to my channel, and I will see you in my next video.